Meghan Markle loudly booed and heckled as she steps on the red carpet of Venice Film Festival for photo opportunity. As the sun began to set over the stunning canals of Venice, the anticipation for the annual Venice Film Festival reached a fever pitch. Celebrities from all corners of the globe were set to grace the iconic red carpet, but one name loomed larger than the rest, Meghan Markle. The Duchess of Sussex, known for her high-profile life and controversial departure from royal duties, stepped into the spotlight with a mix of glamour and trepidation. However, what unfolded was far from the warm reception she might have hoped for. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. The moment Meghan emerged from her vehicle, dressed in a striking black gown that hugged her figure perfectly, the atmosphere shifted. Excited fans and photographers were ready to capture the moment, but a palpable tension hung in the air. As she walked the carpet, a wave of boos and heckles erupted from a section of the crowd. The scene was electric, and the juxtaposition of her poise against the backdrop of audible disdain created a striking image. To understand the context of this moment, we must revisit Meghan Markle's journey. From the moment she entered the royal family in 2018, she became a subject of fascination and scrutiny. Her marriage to Prince Harry was celebrated by many, but also met with criticism, especially as she broke new ground as a biracial woman in the British monarchy. The couple's decision to step back from royal duties in early 2020 sent shockwaves through the media and the public, leading to a whirlwind of headlines and speculation. In the years since, Meghan has carved out a new path in Hollywood, launching projects that emphasize her commitment to social justice and mental health awareness. Yet, her journey has been marred by controversy, as she often finds herself at the center of public debates regarding privacy, celebrity culture, and the role of the monarchy in contemporary society. The Venice Film Festival is a prestigious event that attracts the creme de la creme of the film industry. It is a place where cinematic achievements are celebrated and stars are born. However, it is also a stage for public opinion, where crowd reactions can be as much a part of the spectacle as the films themselves. With paparazzi snapping photos and fans cheering for their favorites, the red carpet is a litmus test for a celebrity's current status in the public eye. Meghan's appearance at this festival was particularly notable, as it marked a significant return to public engagements after a period of relative quiet. While some fans welcomed her back, others expressed their discontent. The booze echoed through the air, a reminder that her royal past still looms large over her present. The strong reaction to Meghan's appearance raises questions about celebrity culture and public perception. In an era where social media amplifies voices, both supportive and critical, celebrities are often subject to intense scrutiny. The dichotomy of love and hate can be startling, especially for someone like Meghan, who has been both vilified and celebrated throughout her career. Critics argue that the public's response to Meghan is indicative of a broader societal issue regarding race, gender, and the expectations placed on women in the public sphere. The backlash she faces is not simply about her actions, but reflects deeper societal tensions. For many, her story is emblematic of the struggles faced by women who dare to defy traditional roles or challenge the status quo. The media's role in shaping public opinion cannot be understated. Reports surrounding Meghan have often gone beyond mere coverage, delving into sensationalism that can distort perceptions. Tabloids have been particularly ruthless with headlines that frequently misrepresent her actions or intentions, contributing to the polarized views among the public. At the Venice Film Festival, the media's presence was overwhelming. As Meghan walked the carpet, cameras flashed and reporters clamored for interviews, but the narrative was already set. The boos and heckles were magnified by the lens of media scrutiny, turning a moment meant for celebration into one of conflict. Despite the hostile reception, Megan maintained her composure. With a smile that seemed to radiate confidence, she continued to pose for photos, demonstrating a resilience that has characterized her journey. In many ways, her response to the backlash is a testament to her strength. She has spoken about the challenges of navigating public life, particularly in a world where every misstep is magnified. In interviews, Megan has often addressed the toll that public scrutiny takes on mental health. Her emphasis on mental well-being resonates with many, 
especially in an age where discussions about mental health have become increasingly normalized. By continuing to advocate for these issues, she aims to shift the narrative from one of scandal to one of empowerment.